So hey everybody, it's Jay, and whether you know me as Jay, or John, or JC, or Jay Cleveland, or even just Payne, thank you so much for popping in uh, for checking out this video. I have a little project I'm working on, now that I have a little bit of unexpected free time, I'm doing some, some branching out, doing some things, uh, some more independent publishing or independent projects uh, in, the, in the works, so I'm looking for your help to help me out with a big project that's kind of time what a time crunch because i'm trying to do it just in time for father's day which is coming up in a few weeks uh, something i pitched to the publication is a piece on fathers or father's day folks and what fathers mean and kind of the diversity of what fathers are because to come a recent conversation with some guys i know we just kind of discussing about what fathers and i have been blessed to have lived 45 years or so on this planet and have had my father there every step of the way sometimes that seems like a great thing and sometimes it seems like why is this guy here but you know despite whatever whatever i get to have whatever back and forth i have my actual father i've had an actual father and been blessed to have him and he'd have me for support for the entire time and learning from other guys who don't have that or didn't have that or had very weird sort of father and son relationships this is for guys specifically um pitch an idea to talk about what the diversity of the fatherhood and the father dynamic is and how it really may seem and i need to get a little bit past the anecdotes so i'm looking for some input from you guys so i have a form if you look into the comments here there's a link to my website jclevenpain.net slash fathers jclevenpain.net slash fathers if you click on the link there it's a very quick survey it's as quick as you want it to be just asking questions on what are your views as a father or for fathers from the standpoint of a adolescent child from the standpoint of a, an adult child and from the standpoint from a spouse and spouse can be any way you want to define that in the setting as that goes so just answer those three questions if you have a little time i appreciate that a little bit of demographics just basically age ethnicity uh gender and what it is you think or anything you think that might be different from you to anyone else that may be taking it such as you come from a different country or you come from some very distinct background or something that's very odd in your origin story that you believe makes you special because you are special but whatever it is do you think is a little different from what is the standard view and the standard view set yes yes adele females can answer this it is there for um that's why i had to figure out how i was going to answer it and if you don't have a spouse don't answer as a spouse you don't care for it it's just asking questions on your views of fatherhoods as from an adolescent child basically how did you think about fathers when you were a kid how do you think about fathers now that you're an adult how do you think about fathers if you're the spouse of a father and that could be a male or female which is why i put spouse and if you have no spouse you have no significant other just skip that one on his own and then i'm just looking for some demo uh stuff for just so i can kind of place it so i can say so many 30 year olds and so many men and blah 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 i'm not looking for anything specific or anything specific demographic wise so there's no question on who you are and i'll probably not be able to tell who you are from the actual descriptions but i'm trying to do some new stuff as i'm in my new beginnings my newfound freedom if you will so i have the freedom to kind of do things uh without having to answer to a few people on, on what exactly it is i have to produce so i'm trying to produce something fairly independent trying to do it fairly quickly since father's day is coming up you have a few minutes it'll take as long as you want to just three questions your views on fathers from the standpoint of an adolescent how you looked at it as a kid views from fathers from the standpoint as an adult how you look at it now and your views on fathers as a spouse and spouse is kind of open-ended you can skip that one if you want to uh, once again that website is at facebook i'm sorry the website is at jclevenpain.net slash fathers fathers with an s and you can just take a quick look at it answer the question if you have any more questions about it uh just message me any way you can any way you want to this video will be on different a bunch of different platforms asking out the request so whatever platform it is put it in the comments or reach out to me specifically the big thing i want to say is thank you everybody for uh being friends being kind being there and uh much make sure that you all know that you are definitely 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 needed so if you need something you need some help for anything reach out because i got a little extra time right now but this most specifically thing is that what you're doing right now is extremely important your path is your path 
and you must follow your path even if that path seems to get a little windy a little woody i'm back in my backyard so it's got a little bit of um woodland trees and and bugs and all those stuff like that so whatever it is the path that you're on despite the one the winding turns and sometimes the steep cliffs that it seems to walk you towards your path is very important i'm learning that myself so we'll get together and talk about that right now but at the moment i'm looking for some input on fathers and if you have deeper input or more questions just reach out we'll figure it out we're all learning this thing together life is how it is it is what it is until it isn't and right now lucky that still is thank you so much so signing out as john or jay or jc or jay cleveland or Payne. thank you so much for checking this out and considering working on the survey for me and if you do more to consider uh just drop it in there like i said the results will be anonymous i won't have any idea who you are and if it's, there's some problems with the survey because trust me i have problems sometimes typing in things let me know so i can fix it as soon as possible thank you so much live from my selfie stick yes i actually own more than one selfie stick in my backyard this is jay signing out from now we'll give you more details on how the survey goes and the final product if it if the pitch works the final product where it, where it ends up